Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. So here is the all action Dennis Bermudez. He averages nearly 10 takedown attempts per 15 minute fight. Wrestler by trade. We all can remember the all time classic against Matt Grice at UFC 157. This is a man who has a lot of big wins to his credit. Clay Guida, Tatsuya Kawajiri, Hani Jason. He can beat you any number of different ways. Hard to know exactly what Bermudez's approach will be on any given Saturday night, Joe. Dennis Bermudez, back under the bright lights tonight. This guy has devastating one-punch knockout power amongst the very best in the world at delivering a single blow to end the fight. Bruce Lee was quoted as saying the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style, and Bruce Lee himself certainly fits the bill. The founder of Jeet Kune Do and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts, he is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. As good a combination of speed, striking, unpredictability, and precision as we've ever had in martial arts, good to see Bruce Lee making the UFC walk tonight. This guy has some of the best defense I've ever seen inside the octagon, and they say that defense is the best offense. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Both fighters are 31, with similar height and some differences in reach. And with the official introductions, here is the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment U.S. fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler with a professional record on. 17 wins, 9 losses. He stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Lindenhurst, New York, Dennis the Madness Bermudez. And now he's facing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is gonna go down right now. First round underway. All right, here he is, the founding father of modern MMA, Bruce Lee, ready to go for round one. The speed and the angle is just absurd, and a hard guy to simulate in training. You think you got a beat on him, and then you end up twitching on the canvas. So we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. All right, first round is underway, and you know what to look out for here. The powerful overhand punches. That is a big part of his game plan. Every time he makes this walk, it is his go-to punch. We'll see if he can find a home for it early tonight. Push kick there to the body. Bermudez gets hit by that leg kick. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. This could be it. Nice defense on the single leg takedown. You can tell he's worked on that. And he's up. Three minutes to go here, round one. Oh, 
work. Good control here. All right, so not enough action there on the ground. The referee brings the fight back to the feet, and we are back underway. Bermudez is in trouble. He's hurt. He's hanging on. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Powerful left hand. And he looks for the takedown. Changes his stance. He's down. Oh, he left his head wide open to absorb that straight hand. He has shown a vulnerability here by leaning in right into his opponent's range. here by Bermudez. He lands a big shot from the bottom. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Ooh, Ooh. big elbow. Back to full guard, very nice. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Lee. Beautiful sweep. Into full guard, nice reversal. Showing some good defense here on the ground by controlling that arm. Full mount. Oh. And oh. it's reversed. Horns out for the end of round one. And there's a nice head kick that lands. And here's another head kick. And here's one more perfectly placed head kick. Incredible highlights in that round. Breathe. All right, let's get him some water. Take a drink. All right, here we go. Listen, you're doing absolutely awesome. Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual. All right, round two. Look for him to go on the attack early in this round to try to pick up where he left off in the last round. His opponent was dazed and in big trouble when that round ended. That one hurt. How about that shin? Good defense there. Well, he got cracked. Nice kick to the body. Going for the takedown here. Nice shot there. Takedown landed by Bermudez. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Lands with a big elbow. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Big body punch. He postures into place. Full guard now. Showing good defense here, controlling that arm, keeping him from hitting him. Three minutes to go. Bermudez is lower. John now starting to show signs of swelling. Lee getting worked to the body by that elbow. Moves to full guard. up. Bermudez is hammer fist there. That one gets blocked. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. He's mounted him. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. Excellent movement here on the ground. All right, so he just decides to get up here, Joe. Level change there. Take down. He hits him with a hammer fist. He passes to half guard. One minute.
minute to go. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Oh, Vicious elbow. elbow lands to the head. He's moved back into side control. Busy as he looks to improve position here. Oh, he's mounted him. Look out for the arm. Look out for the arm. And the horn sounds on round two. Let's take a look at some of the action here. Here's a perfect head kick. And here's another clean shot that lands. And here's a very nicely executed double leg takedown. Very exciting round. Listen, you're always starting to slow up a little bit, and that's fine. Not going to be a problem if you just start using your defense better. Keep those hands up. Jenny Andrade to get us going. Third round underway. Oh, nice strike landed there by the New Yorker, Dennis Bermudez. Both fighters throwing heat now. Head kick there blocked by Bermudez. Ooh, that shot was blocked. The hook lands on the counter. Lee gets tagged by that kick. That can't feel real good, Joe. Total strikes. Takedown attempt is good. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. And he's going to transition to the back. Covering up, doing a nice job of blocking those shots from the top. Trying to spin to the back. Big punch from the bottom. He establishes back control. And now he's in full mount. Controlling him from behind. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Just reached the midway point of the fight. He gets his back. Now he gets the full mount again. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. With two minutes and change to go in round three. Inside control once again. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Back to side control. He moves to the Mount of Crucifix. This is ugly. It looks like he's hunting for an arm here. He's isolated the arm. He's pinning down the wrist. Now he wants to connect his other hand to his forearm for leverage. Oh, we're getting a finish here. This is getting tighter and tighter. He might have to tap. It was a beautiful job setting up that submission, and once he got it, the fight was over. Yeah, that is high-level stuff out of him there, Joe, to finish the submission. It's one thing to get the dominant position. It's another thing to close the show, and he certainly did that here tonight. That's a big one. And here we see it from another angle. Beautiful technique here, and the tap. And one more time. Nice technique here on this submission. So there he is, your winner by submission. That could hold up as one of the better subs of the year. Near perfect execution tonight. We get the official decision from Bruce Buffer.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, four seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by tap out, Dennis Madness for Cuba. Well, the celebration is on in the corner after the big submission win here tonight. He told us during fight week that he needed to prioritize a finish here. Decisions Thank you for watching. Please wait for more videos. See you soon.